And I hear every once in a while a customer calling up saying they start their electric drive test. And all of a sudden, the communication to their power analyzer is lost. And the first thing I mentioned is, well, do you have or are you using shielded Ethernet cables? And that's usually uh, the, the case uh, for the issue. Uh, you get high EMI environments, especially from the pulse width modulated signals coming out of the inverter. And you need to make sure that you're using shielded Ethernet cables to achieve noise immunity. So at minimum, I suggest using shielded Ethernet CAT6 or greater cables. And as you see in the diagram here on the right, uh, the top one has the metal shielded uh, Ethernet connector on there compared to the one I've placed a red X through, uh, typically the plastic styled Ethernet, which is not shielded at all. So uh, ideally, uh, the connection that you want to ultimately consider is using a fiber optic Ethernet solution for the ultimate noise immunity, and you're going to gain isolation from the high voltage and current environments. So you'll be able to isolate the two points of that Ethernet cable through a fiber optic connection.